All right, welcome to a quick little episode. Apple just released iOS 18.1 Beta 5. As I said in my preview previous video where we talked about the follow-up of the iOS 18.1 Beta 4 and what all things are expected to arrive on the iOS 18.1 Beta 5, I predicted it right. We have iOS 18.1 Beta 5 today. Let's go. I am really excited for it. Why? Because this is a big update. It came at around 1 gigabyte. And uh, the exciting part is that there are possibilities that we are going to get new AI features, all new AI features, every feature on this beta. But sadly, I do not have an iPhone 15. So, so sorry, boys. I can't showcase all of those features and any of those AI features of Apple intelligence to you guys. But don't worry, I'll arrange it for you guys. And I'll make sure to publish a video on Apple intelligence and new features really, really soon by tomorrow probably so make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notification anyways let's get back to the topic for people who are using iphone 15 or below i have a good news for you as well because there is a possibility that we might get some ai features really really soon and why i'm saying this it is related to ios 18.1 beta 5 i checked the codes of the ios 18.1 beta 5 and guess what there is a reference of ai features on the older models the models which i'm talking about is gonna be iphone 15 and the iphone 14 pro so yeah people using older devices older than 14 pro i'm so sorry for you guys but no ai features for you but there is a small chance that we might see some apple intelligence features indirectly coming onto these devices the 14 pro and the 15 yeah i'm happy because i'm a 14 pro user let me know down in comments below what device are you using because i know a lot of my subscribers are using a 14 pro and a 15 it is a bit too early for me to talk about ios 18.1 beta 5 because i have just installed it on my device and i have to play with it and just explore it what all new features are here and new things are here i'm pretty sure there are some hidden features i'm going to talk about it in my next video so make sure to subscribe and turn on notification but until then we will just talk about what all things are here there are bug fixes and then the one bug which was really irritating it is now finally fixed it is related to control center the control center was bugging out like crazy we were having some animation bugs on the control center and uh, the wi-fi was apparently getting disconnected that bug is also now fixed on the beta 5 but 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 that's not it there are more bug fixes the irritating bug which was respring again and again so this was something which was on my phone only apparently because i talked to some of you guys and you guys were not having this issue but whenever i was using carplay and i tried to do something on my phone uh not every time but like uh four times out of five so like basically every time but yeah s most of the times my device would just respring for no reason which is now finally fixed on this update i checked it and fingers crossed i hope so that it is fixed well that's pretty much it for today's quick little episode thank you so much for watching this video till the end this is me jay aka tech hyped and i am signing off peace out and subscribe for more